That is a human baby. <laughs> Welcome back, ladies, ladies, and gentlemen. I'm your host, Ian Epp, and this is another Lolita Play Sanatorium. Where we last left off, we just got out of Mount Massive, and I solved a bunch of word puzzles from an anime protagonist. I about lost my dang mind during it, and I have a kitty cat waking up over there and wants to be part of the camera show. Cam what the hell did I just say? Whatever, it's been a long day. Hi, kitty. Anyway, we're going to jump right back into it. So remember to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff below, and I'll see you in a minute. Alright, so there's bug people everywhere. There's... Hmm, this thing has some kind of mechanical harness. Apparently I'm no longer Max, I'm whatever this freaking guy is. This building appears to have served some special This function. thing is just sh out eggs like crazy. Oh, now that I'm looking at you, you're gonna be shy about it? Okay. Warning. Attempted breach of security barrier by unidentified beings. Recalibrate ID harness before entering field. Okay. Warning. Hmm. Okay. Wearing this harness, perhaps they'll think I'm one of them. It's worth trying. Oh, that's a harness? Okay. I don't see a harness on you anywhere. ID Whatever, man. Drone guard class, sector seven. Proceed. Who the hell is this guy? Apparently, some comic book character. Ugh, I can hardly stand to look at these beasts. You sound very dignified, though. Drone guard class not permitted within the queen's chamber. Entry denied. That's a door. Rap. Rap. <laughs> Man, those legs, though. Okay, let's see what's... Oh, God, it sounds so squishy. Oh, oh, God, these are doors? Oh, God, the way he stands, he's like... He's like, um, uh, freaking Spudgegar. He's like, ah! Ooh. <laughs> Who the hell are these people? A handsome young Cyclops. I hope he can help me. A handsome young cyclops. By the makers! Grimwall! You're Grimwall! But what are you doing here? Why have you returned to us? I thought Gromna had everything under control. Grimwall? Where the crap am I? Name? I don't remember much. Just waking up in this <clears throat> hive and having to battle a few insectoids. I had to use this strange device that I found What the, the hell is going on over here? to pass their security forces. It's an ID harness. Gron built them for the insectoids since they lost their sight. With that on, you look like another bug to them. That's why they're not swarming all over you. Look, hmm. my name is Gravin. We need to talk more. But until the work slows down, I'm stuck here. Afterwards, I'm going back to my pod. We can meet there. My pod's globe code is Grenasser. Use it if you need to get in there for anything. Okay, this is becoming so weird. What the it's hell? It's some kind of alien child with two eyes and two arms. Okay, now. That is a human baby. It's some kind of alien child. This monster is also a machine. I'm so confused. He's like, who? <laughs> who? Ancient talk. Oh, okay. Talk to me. What is your function? I serve butter. That's all I do. Oh my god! Who designed these robotics? Her Majesty the Queen? I require my ID harness to be upgraded. Upon whose operation will I grant the procedure? Um... You delay in your response. I am living. Return when you can produce the proper authorization. Authorization. Okay. You know where I Look, can get. I'm too busy to talk. Okay. I just need some authorization, man. Help a brother out. I got like four arms and. I'm assuming two legs if I'm looking at that right. At least this guy seems to walk a little faster. A great machine of some sort. Its size alone speaks of untold power. Can I... can I f*** with it? Guess not. I, this is weird that these are apparently doors. That's right. Grap. Entry denied. Uh... That's right. 
Correct. Entry denied. Okay, do I, I thought that guy gave me a password. Hold up, let me go back and kick that guy's ass. He gave me the wrong password. Yo, bitch, what's up? Look, I'm too busy to talk now. The couriers are delivering embers from the furnace at a fantastic rate. I'll meet you later at my pod when they shut the furnace down. If they shut the furnace down. He said some kind of password. I don't know what it was, and I'm too lazy to stop this recording and go back and check. Oh my god. Not so many. Slow down. Too many in the machine will overheat. Hmm. This insect is hooked up to a machine, and the levers must control the furnace. Mm. It would be enjoyable. They are refining fuel oh. for their mechanized Wait. parts. What would be enjoyable now? What the hell are you talking about, dude? Were you planning on sticking your dick in there or something? Why? They are refining fuel for their mechanized parts. Talk to the me, dude. The insects are pumping a bellows to control the furnace. The bellows. They are used to fan the flames of the infernal machine. Can I put more junk in there? Bugs flying up that tube. Where does it lead? Hmm. A okay, defense sir. mechanism for Grevin's pod. Hmm. Password. Renaseer. Enter. Oh, yay. Okay, I'm in here. Ooh. Give me whatever that is. Sledgehammer should come in handy. Give me that. Four arms I can hit four times harder. Graven's tools. Looks like grooming equipment more than anything. Graven. Okay. Wonder if Graven has any good crystals. What are crystals? What is this? I'm confused. And now. Our breaking story this evening. During a helicopter sweep in the search for another missing child in a troubled remote community of Warrendale, authorities were startled <coughs> to discover what appears to be a gigantic insect hive attached to Mount Cytaria close to the ancient mechanical ruins. Details are sketchy at this point, but some sources have estimated that the visible the portion here? of the hive is only a small part of the greater whole. More details on this breaking story as it develops. In an attempt to hold the this of the insect horde that is sweeping across our nation, leading entomologists Sorry, I have to watch it way too many cold, uh, and examine the ever-growing hive. When asked why he was risking his own life on this mission, Romna simply replied that he was willing to sacrifice anything to stop the infestation. When he heard the news, President Agris said, Romna they have a is president truly a great here? man, and we all wish him much success. Today, I'm so confused. the nation breathed a collective <coughs> sigh of relief as word from Gromna finally reached our closest outpost to the hive. Gone for months and presumed dead, it turns out that Gromna's team is not only alive, but they have found a method to slow the horde's infestation. Remaining near the hive, the team will continue their research in an attempt to stop the horde. Hi, Graven. I guess you're not in. You must I'm be so out confused. helping Gromna save the world or something. Uh, he's technically enslaved right now, I, I think. I love you, and I miss you. And I really look forward to you coming back to me soon. Goodbye, sweetheart. Yeah, so your, your husband's enslaved right now. Alrighty then. Well, then I think it's time to go smash some shit up. Hmm. This pipe has been fixed recently, though not too well. <coughs> Hmm. Can I sledge it? Drones, start the bellows. Seal the pipe. To continue pumping with that dam, it would overheat the furnace. Aha. Let me go over here and start doing stuff. With that bug gone, I can reach the controls. I'll shut down this abominable furnace. <laughs> I like how they're probably very confused. The mechanized arm survived the fire. I wonder if it can be used against the beasts. Hell yeah, take it. Do whatever it is you gotta do, this man. This is more complex than I imagined. I'm very confused there by this chapter. There many controls, all interrelated. 
Oh, what the hell is this? Uh, what the hell is this? This is more complex than I... That is a live dude just stuck to that thing. Uh... Can I give him a little... <laughs> the hell? Uh, what the crap is this? I don't know what's going on here. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, that thing is there. Okay. I'm very confused. Okay. Uh... Two thousand years later. All right, give me a minute. Uh... uh... Okay, I guess I gotta make these match. Maybe? Uh, cause... Okay. Let's try going up. Oh, no, no, we it. Oh, okay. Okay, I think I got it now. Yay! I had to think about that one for a minute. I was like, duh. Okay. God dang it. I'm, I'm not very big brain. Uh, that's one thing I've learned from this. I can figure out the Silent Hill puzzles pretty good. But second, I, I, some of these ones are just in my brain hard right now. All right, Gavin, you mother what's going on? There you are. I was beginning to get worried. I thought something terrible might happen to you at the furnace. Especially since your memory is gone. No, something terrible did I happen. I had a brain aneurysm. <laughs> I wouldn't even know my own name if you hadn't told me. Every Cyclopean child knows the name of Grimwall. You're the great hero of the War of the One. I'm the great hero of the what now? War of the One. Can you tell me about it? Oh my. You are confused, aren't you? <clears throat> the War of the I War do have a horn was coming a pivotal my head. point in the history of our people. For years, we had fought the insectoids, neither side gaining ground as the planet was ravaged by countless battles. The makers, creators of all and of nothing. Sounds like an IDW comic. Not gonna action. lie. They spoke to the leaders of both sides through grand visions, declaring that there was to be one final battle for supremacy. The victory Supremacy. would rule the planet, and the defeated race would be forced underground, never to return to the surface again. We won? Yes, thanks to you. You destroyed nearly a third of the troops, all by yourself. Damn, I'm a badass. If we won, then why are these things back above ground? No one really knows. Actually, no one really believed the story of the War of the One, or thought that there were any insectoids. Until now. That evil machine will be silent for a while. Evil? It's just a furnace. Isn't it? The thing was burning children, Gravin. Cyclopean children. What? God damn. But how can this be? Grumna would never allow such a thing to happen. That thing was burning Cyclopean I didn't even... Grumna. That's the name the bugs were using at the <coughs> furnace. They said he's giving the orders to burn the children's bodies. That's absurd. He's my mentor. A brilliant entomologist. He'd never... Ento... what? Entomologist. 
He's our foremost specialist on insects. It sounds That's like you got brainwashed, dude. Chose him for this mission. Mission? What mission? What the hell is going on here? We were sent here to examine this hive a few months ago. We were captured, but Gromna convinced the queen to put aside her plans of conquest and negotiate a peace treaty. Since then, it's been peaceful for both sides. In fact, tomorrow is the day that both leaders will meet to sign the treaty. That sounds like a I trap. It's true, Robin. Something is terribly wrong here, and I think that this Gromna person is somehow involved. You must help me. I'm sorry, but I can't. Not unless you have some physical proof to back up these wild accusations. Very well. If proof is what you want, then that's what you'll get. Grabin, Chick-Tok requires authorization to upgrade my ID harness. Who can do that? Normally, Gromna is the only one who can authorize such upgrades. But with the increased activity in the Queen's chambers, he remains there almost exclusively. I think we can fool Chick-Tok if I make my position. I'm just invested in the story, sorry. What should I say? <laughs> Tell him that your authorization comes from Graben, protege of Gromna, honorable assistant to Her Majesty. That should do it. Okay. Take my advice. That harness you're wearing won't get you past every security device. You might want to see the cyber technician for an upgrade. That's what I was gonna do. Later, bitch. I require my ID harness to be upgraded. Abandus Athenish. Graven, protege of Gromna, honorable assistant to Her Majesty. Graven, full well I search my datanks for confirmation. My records indicate that Graven is the assistant to Gromna. However, his authorization alone is not enough. I will need to verify. That you are of sufficient age to be placed within I am right at now. least seven, sir. Proceed to link scanner for positive age identification. You just have to see my ID. <laughs> hmm. The opening is far too small for my arm. Hmm. Well, then I'll have to put this second. That one. won't solve anything. Come on, put your arm in there, dude. Eve of Retribution? What about Eve of Retribution? Not be that in need of service. The Eve of Retribution is known by us all. As of tomorrow, we will return to our rightful position as the dominating race of the planet. I fucking knew it! It's a trap! We shall collect the debt. It's a trap! Been unpaid for decades. What plan do you speak of? Your memory banks must be fluctuating. Ramna has seen the error of his kind's ways, and God. has come to aid us in our desire for revenge. With his gift of cybernetics, we shall once again rule the surface. Jesus Christ. How will this gift aid us? Are we not mighty enough to conquer the Cyclops without them? Without the speed of cybernetics? We would be vulnerable to the nuclear fire which the enemy controls. Incinerated before we even reach the city. That uh, sounds but like a you problem, dude. We will be swarming within the walls of the capital before their hands can even reach the launch button. That sounds the fucking disgusting. The age of the insectoid. It is inevitable. Alright, uh, well, we're gonna do whatever we can to stop that bull from happening. If I could just fit my damn arm in here. Come on, put your, put your robot arm in there. Yeah, there we go. Age requirements verified. Upgrade authorized. Step forward to have ID harness upgraded. Free tab. Hey, right, come on, dude. F me up. Do a cutscene now. What's going on this treatment? time, man? What treatment? A treatment. They found a way to slow down the disease. It says here that a Dr. Morgan was ultimately responsible for developing the DNAV treatment. Didn't you study with the Dr. Morgan back in med school? 
I was still a sophomore when he earned his doctorate. Damn, huh. Max, the you thick. Hope. It's supposed Seriously, to accelerate though, look at the that. growth of the Woo. DNAV, almost doubling the lifespan. Sorry, of I, get, I can't get over how thick this middle-aged man is. If Quetzalcoatl without conventional modern medicine. <sighs> Well, hey, if Morgan is close to a cure, well, that's why she was a true you. cure, then maybe he can use another set of hands. Maybe it's time to pack up here and go home. So Max and his wife are doing some stuff in the jungle about diseases, and Morgan's oh, doing something. Fire in my laser! Sorry. And they're doing something with children. That's upsetting. All right, let's go. Let's go authorize that queen all over the place. Royal guard class confirmed. Enter. Hell yeah, yes. let me in, Queen. Yes, Queen, I'm gonna slay. This Cyclops is half bug. That is disgusting looking. Who He's are so you? squiggly. Grit Gritza. Gritza? Yes, that's my name, Gay Queen. I love him already. Where are you from? You're my new Marty. <laughs> Where are Dum. you from? Dum, 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 dum. Team? Team? What team is that? Search. Research team. Sent to examine insectoids. Gramna, the leader. The betrayer. Ooh. Gramna? I knew he was a fucking traitor. Is your leader and betrayer? How did he betray you? Betrayer? He did this to many me. My body. Not Cyclops anymore. The <coughs> beast. His experiment God dang. left me a freak. I am a freak now. You're a freak! You're a freak! I'm just playing. <laughs> What has he done to you? What experiments? Yes. Quest. Oh, sorry, dude. Say it one more time. What has he done to you? Yes. Quest. Once you <laughs> live forever, see insects as the answer. Ugh. What? I don't understand what answer. That is some expression to that writing. Goddamn. What are you doing here? My duty to the queen. What duty is that? Tend the young ones. They are fragile children. So young. Dude, you're gonna get me demonetized with that. Cool. These bottles have children in them? Clones, grumnas, pets. Ugh. Well, Grumna's a butt fucking traitor, so we're gonna go kick his ass. God I'll burn all of these grubs before I leave here. Cyclops, babies. In bottles? Baby bottles! Baby bottle pop! Baby bottle Dr. pop! Morgan? Sorry. What test is this? Ah. He just nice. got baby juice in a bottle. You're just in time. This is a test of the subject's threshold. The serum will travel directly to the neurotransmitters of the brain and without actually harming the monkey, cause it to feel excruciating pain all over its body. What? Ah, oh, you're an asshole. That's not an experiment! It's torture! What possible purpose? When you outrank me in lab years, Max, you can question the methods. I outrank you in method I acting! I have way better voice acting abilities than you! A valuable lesson in scientific research, Max. In layman's terms, you can't make an omelette without breaking a few <laughs> He's not a layman, you dipstick. He's also an ar a freaking scientist. God. What the heck? What can I do here? No, my huh. strength will break the bottle. I need something to cut it free. Grab. Cut it free. Okay, let's see. Dude, can you help me with that? No, I guess you can't. Alright, we'll figure this out. 
on the next episode. You guys know what time it is. Sorry. That's all the time I have for today, but we'll figure this out. We'll free those babies and we'll stop the insectozoids on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Remember to like, comment, subscribe to all that good stuff down below. I'm your host, Ian Epp, and this has been Lolita Play Sanitarium. Have a good one. Bye.